Bienvenidas, bienvenidos a la segunda batalla de las bestias Miquel en ronda 4 entre Goblius de Draido y Ovelius de Builder. Comenzamos. Goblius, la rana voladora, estira su lengua y electrifica a sus enemigos o les retiene. Lanza misiles de la espalda sacando un panel. Salta, vuela, lucha en tierra. Es bastante completo. Superó la velocidad terrorífica de Márbaras, consiguiendo atar sus piernas, electrocutándole y haciéndole caer a la tierra. Una dura batalla contra Camarón. La bestia Camarón lanzó su misil. Goblius lo pudo esquivar y una lluvia de misiles acabó con él. Una durísima batalla contra el elefante triturador <coughs> hizo a Goblius tirar de estrategia con las patas, con los misiles y destruyó sus patas mientras caía, cogió con la lengua al jinete electrocutándolo su parte viva y acabó con él. Dragón Ovelius con su poderoso pico en un ataque giratorio le está dando ventaja en sus batallas lanza misiles del pecho y rayos por la boca también en la primera batalla atravesó de lado a lado al poderoso Taurus y le remató con misiles en la segunda batalla atravesó con su poderoso pico una vez más a los hermanos Iguanas y le remató con un rayo no hizo falta más que su pico para derrotar al príncipe Geruinius. Atravesó a esta bestia y ganó la batalla. ¿Cuál de estas dos terribles bestias, Miquene, sería la ganadora? Espero sus votos. Muchas gracias. Hi and welcome back again. This is 16 to 12 pets speaking. Welcome to the second Mick Enemies to fight in round 4 between Goblius from Dido and Obelius from Builder. Let's start. Goblius the frog fights on the ground, jumps and flies, uses his electric tongue to trap or attack his victims and missiles from his back. In round 1, the fast Marvaras was surprised by Goblius' tongue, trapping his feet and electrifying him, and he fell into the ground, exploded, and Goblius obtained the victory. Goblius avoids Camarón's missiles, and he throws continuous missiles to the pincer beast and make it explode. A very hard battle against the grinding uh, elephant uh, made Goblius take his strategy to beat him. He throws uh, a rain of missiles onto his legs, make the elephant fall and trap the rider, his living part, with his electric tongue. And That's how Goblius won the battle. Obelius the dragon throws missiles from his stomachs, laser rays from his peak, and attack in a circle way with that terrible peak, which is his main and most powerful weapon. On the first round, Obelius pierced towers from side to side and with his missiles make it explode. Obelius pierced both his one as brothers in round two and with the laser ray make them explode too. His peak was enough to pierce and kill the Prince Kervinius in round three. So that's how Obelius won. Who of those two terrible bikini beasts would be the winner? I'll wait for your votes. Thanks for watching.